first and foremost why cost accounting is important and who does that so first and foremost thing is a manufacturer now the question is who is the manufacturer the one who converts raw material into finished goods so when i talk about cost accounting it is important for every manufacturer to make cost accounting what is the difference in financial accounting it is also mandatory whether you are a business house you are a manufacturer you are a trader whosoever you are who has to do financial accounting that is compulsory but for a manufacturer cost accounting is also compulsory now there are two important things for which this cost accounting is done first to know the total cost i'm talking about total cost which is inclusive of every cost how from raw material to finished goods whatever money you have invested will become a part of total cost because you are a manufacturer you should also know the cost per unit suppose you are manufacturing 1000 units So you will be because there are many factors. It's not important for this one thousand unit to one person. You might be selling it to different person. So because you will be selling it to different person, so you should know what is the cost per unit. That means one unit can be sold for how much money. So the basic concept of cost accounting is it is done for manufacturers. Manufacturers are different from retailers because they produce the goods and sell them. these manufacturers are doing cost accounting to find two different things that is total cost and cost per unit now how we do its calculation is and give a very simple example we will divide our board into certain parts first and foremost i take units then i will take fixed cost when i talk about the word fixed cost it means the cost of machine land building which is fixed you will not be changing the price as per the number of units you will be producing then with the number of units will you will be looking for variable cost now we will add this both together and come to total cost and with the help of total cost we'll be able to find cost per unit and i will just take one more column which is either cost now we will add this both together and come to total cost and with the help of total cost we'll be able to find cost per unit and i will just take one more column which is either profit or loss let's take an example suppose we are a pen manufacturing company and the price of the pen is decided for rupees 10 okay so currently i am taking an example of manufacturing one unit suppose my fixed cost for making pen will be 1 lakh rupees matlab the land the machine everything will include 1 lakh Then suppose my variable cost for making the pen, the plastic, the ink, the nib, everything will be for two rupees. So my total cost becomes one lakh two rupees. Now per unit cost, how will find per unit cost? For total cost divided by number of units. So it becomes again your selling cost that you have decided is rupees ten. So let's not calculate. But you are definitely in loss if you are manufacturing one unit. Let's take more. If I manufacture hundred units, then my fixed cost is one lakh. My variable cost is two hundred rupees each. Now we will take a little higher example. Let's suppose that we are making ten thousand units. So I'll be making it for one lakh rupees, which is fixed. Now ten thousand into two will make it twenty thousand. Now this will become one lakh twenty thousand. Now when you divide one lakh twenty thousand with ten thousand, it will become twelve. 
still you are in your loss form rupees 2. So let's make at least one back of it. One back. Then again you will need two lakh rupees. Total will be three lakhs. You will have a per unit cost of rupees three because three lakh will be divided by one lakh and now you will have a profit of seven rupees. What I'm trying to tell you is as soon as you uh, increase making the number of units, your total cost will increase but your per unit cost will decrease which leads you from loss to profit. So now if this company is going to make 10 lakh units, then that 10 lakh units will increase your profit from 7. You will gain more profit. This is how our manufacturing concern works. Am I clear to you? Thank you.